Good morning, camera. Today is Nevaeh's birthday, and we're gonna go sing her happy birthday. I already like brushed my teeth, washed my face, took out the took out Nova. So that's why I still look like this. I am um. So I already took out Nova. So I'm gonna go sing happy birthday to my baby. All right, so we're gonna go say happy birthday to Nevaeh. So we're gonna go say happy birthday to Nevaeh. Let's go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Nevaeh. Happy birthday to you. One, two, three. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday. How you feel to be 10? You feel good? You're not in the single digits anymore. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs> All right. All right. So guys. Okay. All right. So guys, we got so much stuff to do today. Um, somebody's is getting her first ID, her military ID today, and then we are after that. We have like some other stuff planned in between. And then later she has to do her 10 year old checkup. Um, so they were trying to tell me like she didn't need to do a 10 year old checkup. But guys last year when I didn't take her um, to like get any checkups because of COVID. They seriously called me and was like you forgot your daughter's 9 year old checkup. And I was like I didn't know we did that. So I set her one up for when she turned 10 as well so i'm gonna do her 10 year old checkup she's also um getting a sports physical too because we're moving so when we move i don't want to go through the hassle okay um next year trying to find her some sports to play and they say she can't play because she ain't got her physical so we do her 10 year old checkup we're getting her sports physical and um also since nabelle does have eczema we're gonna see if they are able to like switch her medicine to where we're going um or see how we go about that because we're not going on a military base um uh, since some of you know i don't know if i told some of you guys but my husband's not getting out of the military but um uh, he's going recruiter so we're not moving on a military base at all nowhere near one so we're going to actually see like is there a way for us to just to transfer her medicine over to them uh, what else? What else? Y'all like my bunny? I think it's so cute. Let me just go ahead and start cooking for her breakfast. I am gonna just cook her something um, quick and easy. We're just, I'm giving her salmon. This is just her breakfast because you guys know, um, if you don't know, I am vegan. Um, <laughs> you don't know, I'm, I'm vegan. And also guys, if you don't know, my name is Visha and welcome back to another video. I know I just started off like singing happy birthday to Nevaeh. So my name is Visha and I am a, I don't want to lead off with that. Like I, guys, I really don't know what to say in my intro. Um, I don't consider myself to be a military wife because even though my husband is in the army, like we were married before he joined and I don't consider myself to be a military wife. Like I don't add his title um, or his job description because you know, but I don't know. Like if you're a military spouse, like let me don't know down below. Like if I even have any military spouses on that watch me, I know I have one for sure. But if I have like any other military spouses that watch me, like just let me know. Like I don't use his rank. Um, I don't, I don't know, like, I know a lot of people, like, use it, like, 
and they channel grow because like they target military wives but I want my channel to be more than just a military wife and there's nothing wrong with military wives it's just my face just set it off okay anyways <laughs> let me go ahead and cook for her I am cooking her salmon I am cooking her grits and um, I am cooking her some eggs okay so that's what I'm gonna cook her for breakfast salmon grits and egg if you are Caribbean it's either you doing some type of fish um, and we don't have right now she really likes Bambi I don't have no Bambi and I do not have no um oh Jesus you guys I can't salt saltfish Aki I don't have no Aki so we don't have no Aki right now at all so I'm gonna do her some eggs I'm gonna do her some um salmon since we, I don't have no saltfish and I'm gonna just do her some grits you know if you're in a Caribbean family like you know you know yeah, no. Yeah. Well, let me go ahead and get this done and I'll show you guys her food when it is finished. I'm gonna go ahead and make me some cowboy coffee. If you don't know what that is, you just take the water, boil it on top of the stove, um, put your coffee in it, and when you're done, you just drain it. The coffee inside of your cup. That's it. I brought my crop I bought my um I broke my coffee pot, so I'm making cowboy coffee. You got you guys can actually look that up too. It is a thing. It is a thing. So yeah, let me go ahead and get done to doing what I need to do. I show you guys her food um, when she is done. I mean, I show you guys her food. Now after that, I need to literally start getting ready. Right now it is 7:20. We need to be out of this house by 8:50. So that means I need to cook. I need to cook. Do her hair. Um, cook and do her hair by the time we leave. So yeah. Your military ID. To get my military ID, then we're going to the mall. We're going to the mall. Mm -hmm. oh. And then you have you a... No. No? No. Maybe she's going to buy you a cupcake or a cake. I don't know. <laughs> All right. This is the So that is my best breakfast. Um, I hate when the salmon like when it cooks like that. Oh, well, I did have it in foil too, so but yeah, I air fried it. And um, for her, I'm so like yay! Oh, whoa. yay, 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 baby! I need to know. Oh. Nevea, come eat. Trying to take her picture. Nevea, come eat. All right, so she's gonna eat her breakfast. Let me turn off this fan. Yeah, I air fried. I air fried it. Um, that's what you wear today. Yes. With those jeans. Okay. 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 Thank you. You're very welcome. Y'all don't think that's nasty right there because the vacuum is just charging. It's just charging. How your food tastes? Good. It's good. So what I'm about to do is go ahead and um, fix my coffee. So this is cowboy coffee, you guys. Let me show you. So this is cowboy coffee. Like, it's literally coffee. I just need to go ahead and like strain it. Um, I boiled it, but I want it to like clean up the kitchen first and focus on her before I focus on me. 
So now I'm gonna go ahead and focus on me. What I ate for breakfast was just a banana. Um, I had like a little bit of grits. How do grits taste? It's good? Okay. So I had like a little bit of grits um, cause I did not want to give her all those grits. Even though I made enough serving, it says for one person, but I still didn't want to give her a lot of grits and, and just her two eggs. So she got two eggs, grits, salmon, um, sliced strawberries and grapes. So she should be full y'all because we got so much stuff to do today. I'm not stopping to go get nothing to eat until dinner. Do you hear me? Cause we literally need to be back home no later than um because the appointment at 9 15 the mall doesn't open like some stores don't open until 10 so she will have be quiet nova quiet so she'll have 10 like because we don't even know how long we're going to be waiting in there for the id even though i have an appointment so she and we need to be back on post because her other appointment is on post so what is like 10, 11, 12, 1, 2. So we literally will have like four hours to do everything that we need to do in the mall, which I believe we'll get done in enough time. Um, yeah. And then, what's on my lip? And then come back, y'all. You guys, I've been using like aloe vera um, gel on my face. And because I ran out of my other stuff. I really like it. I need to find like a moisturizer. Like I literally just been just using aloe vera on my face, but I do need to find a moisturizer. It's been good to me. My hands are so ashy because I've been down. At least y'all know I'm cleaning my hands. But let me do what I need to do. I'm gonna get ready. The next time you see us, um, we will be done getting her ID because yeah, I'm not taking the camera on inside of the soldiers center like a lot of you know i already said it i like protecting our soldiers privacy so yeah um yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and finish getting ready and then we can go then we can go then then we can go <laughs> all right guys so we literally just got through um getting her id i'm gonna move because i know people need to park so we just got through getting her ID and I, I was gonna show you guys, but then I was like, no, I can't show you guys. Cause you do have hackers on here who be trying to steal people information. So, but yeah, let me go ahead and move because it's limited parking and we'll see you when we get home. So you guys, we made it back to the house. The mall does not open until, um, here we go. Auntie Margaret on the phone. Happy um, birthday. Thank you. She right here. The mall does not open until like some stores yeah. open at 10 and some stores open at 11. So we're gonna leave here like 10.30. How you feel about getting your ID? Come here. Yeah, I'm vlogging her day. Good. Oh shit. No, you good. How you feel about, how you feel about getting your ID? Your first ID? Good. You feel good? Yes. Ah! When you, when you get your next one? When I turn 14. She can have the next one when she turn 14, y'all. And then if... In four more, in four years. Yeah, he gonna read, yeah. Yeah. Cause my husband is going indefinite after this reenlistment. So she'll be getting, I think one more ID after 14 and then I think that's it. Cause he's going indefinite, so yeah but yeah her first military id like i said i would show you guys the picture but i can't because yeah yeah you ain't gonna use my baby as no pawn to get on post so yeah <laughs> are you happy all right bye we waiting until like i said 11 30 so we can go to the mall when we get to the mall i will let y'all you guys know Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So no one else can make you do. That's why I'm fine. Spend my life with you. I wanna please you in any way I can. I wanna share my world. Don't you understand?
Tell me inside out, out, make my heart speak. Leave no one else. You're all I need. Personality, everything you do. It's me, love. Everything about you. And if you're still here this long, thank you guys so much for sticking with us. Um, still have plenty of more to go. But yeah, I had to do a lot of music in this video only because the mall was playing so much music. Every store that we went into, there was music playing. So we were talking, um, me and Nevaeh were talking, and then I realized like, dang, while I'm editing the video, music is playing and I didn't want to get copyrighted. So my sister had found these boots online um, at JCPenney's and she had told me about it. So I went out, you know, they're really good boots. They were, they were on sale as you guys saw for $29.99. But when you go online, they were actually on sale for $14.99 something. I think I'm going to explain it later to you in the car when I, when we get back in the car. Um. So the size four of these boots were too, Nevada said it was too tight. These are actually good boots um, in the ice stages. Like when you have black ice and all those type of things, I did not want to invest in her in no way type of form any Uggs. And my reason behind it is the fact that she's going to grow out of it. I myself have Uggs, but with me having Uggs, I know that my feet are like the same size, okay? So I still like have my snow boots. Um, I didn't have to buy snow boots for myself, but Nevaeh needed some snow boots. And me buying her Uggs right now is like out of the picture until I know her feet is done growing because Uggs by themselves are like almost, yeah, they're like one to almost $200. 
and I I don't see myself that's just me um, everybody is different I just don't see myself spending that much money on a pair of boots that she will only wear for like a year and that's it so Nevaeh was saying that the size 4 boots were too tight she is in between sizes right now she's like a 4 to a 5 so like not even like a four and a half. The other day I had her try on some Converse's and she was a woman, I mean a men's four Converse's, which is like a women's six. So in the Converse's she has on right now that we got her were a kid's, I think kid's four and a half or a kid's five. So it's definitely like, yeah, she's in be between shoe sizes. I, her size pants went up to she was wearing a 10 12 in pants and now she can just simply wear a size 12 in pants yeah so i'm asking her like do she like the boot and she said that she can fit them they're not flapping off of her feet which is a good thing you guys and yeah so i do want to send a special shout out to me and Theon parents because they really looked out this year um, for Nevaeh where, with winter clothes because we are going to PA. And they asked me like what to get her for her birthday. And I was like, well, we're going to PA. She's going to need, you know, winter clothes. And both of our parents, um, they did come through for us this year on that. So I do certainly greatly appreciate that. Like I'm very honestly, very honestly grateful because we're getting things that she needs and not necessarily what she wanted. Um, her friends did get her, well, one of her friends did get her some poppets and two bits. Um, and I did get her a Build-A-Bear. I think I said I was going to put it in the video. I might put it in the video, like a little snippet showing you that we did go to Build-A-Bear because I did do build a bear for her as well so but yeah she told me this morning she was like mommy you made the best birthday day for me ever and I'm truly happy about that because my husband is not here um he's still not here and he won't be back until you know later so I just later this month so I'm just like excited that you know I was able just me and her to make her birthday day special for her so yeah we're just looking at winter jackets you guys these jackets were expensive like if you have a costco or sam's club car buy your jackets from out of there the jackets in the mall were expensive like they seriously were expensive like 159 dollars for a jacket and when we were in europe buying like these big old winter jackets like this we did not pay like more than probably like $50 for a jacket. So if you have a Sam's Club card or a Costco card, buy your jackets from out of, buy your jackets from out of those areas because yeah, yep, you definitely do that. We about to get the shoes. <laughs> we about to get the shoes. Thank you. Yeah, you too. Okay. Oh, it's okay. I thought it's five. There you go. Yeah, yeah. You got the goods. Mm -hmm. Alright, hold on. Let me get my keys out. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's on manual focus. Auto focus. There we go. So we got the what? Guys, I could have um, I could have did curbside pickup where they could have just came and gave it to me, but I didn't read the whole email. It's all right though. All right, to the house we go. To the house we go. To the house we go. Y'all look at my body. Look at my hair blowing in the wind. Body yaddy 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 yaddy. <laughs> you can take off your mask. You want me to hold it? Hi, Chase. You press that? Yeah. 
Mm -hmm. It does. Happy birthday again, Nevaeh. Thank you. <laughs> okay. I should have done it over there because over here it's kind of dark. But anyways, guys. So, we're done. We went ahead. We ate dinner um, at Olive Garden. I'll put a clip in the video. What I'm going to go ahead and do now is do a haul of what we got. So, we're going to start off with the goods, with the shoes, with the boots, the boots. So these are the boots. These are what you guys had saw her try it on. These were what I was telling you guys, they were 40. Um, they were $14 today, so guys if you guys want your kids to have some good like quality snow boots go and well these are like everyday type boots though but still go to see so you guys can see that i'm not lying 40. tap 40 dollars just for these and i got them for 14. It's sad we gotta put disclaimers in the video. But anyways, I don't care. So I got her a size five because she said the size four was too tight. Okay. So that's what we got from JC Penny. Then you good, Margaret? Oh. Oh. <laughs> And then from old, <laughs> and then from old navy, I just got her some shirts. So just hey guys, I'm really really sorry that um, the quality right now is blurry. I did not have on my glasses, so I could not see that it was blurry because without my glasses, things are naturally blurry. So I do certainly apologize about that. These are just the items that I end up getting from Old, um, from Old Navy. Right. But, oh, and I also sized up on her shirts. Her long sleeves, for some reason, always seem to shrink. So I like this one. Then I got her this one. That said love. Then she got this one. I got her one, two, three, four, five, six. So old navy, she got six shirts. She did the picking of her clothes, guys. I did it. She picked her clothes. And my can y'all see that? Okay, there we go. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Think there we go. I got her that. My camera is about to die. Hold it, thought. I'll be right back. All right, so shot my battery. Okay. Then, you guys, I got her this white t-shirt. Again, like I said, um, we sized up a red one. And this is so that, um, again, layering. We need to go find camis. A black one. Just plain got her this sweater. Oh, we got a 10 12. We need to probably take that back and go get a 14 16. But I got a sweater. And what size did I get in? Okay, this one I got a 14 16 and another sweater. So I just got one. Could you guys see this? Because it kind of looked blurry. And I don't have on my glasses. So hopefully you can see it. Okay, so. I mean, we gotta take this one back to get the right size. So we got five um, pair of jeans. So these, she's a size 12 now. We got these from Walmart. Um, Walmart, Walmart and Children's Place was the same exact price for jeans. So I just stayed at Walmart. 
because I know Walmart pants, um, they have super skinny and they will fit her because Nivelle wear a super skinny and Walmart jeans. These, so all her pants all the way down to the bottom are super skinny. She looks really, really pretty in these and jeans, in these super skinny jeans. She doesn't like, um, She doesn't like like straight legs or you know jeans that don't fit right but these actually look really good on her and i sized up but even with me sizing up like when i wash them and they start shrinking they're gonna shrink down to the perfect size got these and what i do for walmart jeans these right here especially looked it really pretty on her really really pretty on her um what i do for walk when i shop at walmart for her jeans i do not put them in the dryer well i don't put none of our jeans in the dryer i hang them on the clothesline and she wanted these she liked it the khakis because she said the khakis can go with a lot of things so she got five pair of jeans And then the last bag, again from Walmart. People be sleep on Walmart. Go to Walmart. She she picked out this shirt. It's really really pretty. Like it's a knit kind of shirt. She could wear these with some leggings, um, even when it's not cold. So even like going into springtime. And then she picked out these two shirts right here. They were um, two for eight eighty eight, which is good because each one of those plain shirts was four forty four. So two for eight eighty eight, and again, they can be a layered shirt. So for the winter time, what I do for her, she'll wear a cami. She'll wear a cami, then she'll wear a long sleeve shirt, then she'll wear a sweater, then she'll wear her jacket, um, then she'll wear you know her little scully or her beanie. And then she have on her snow gloves or just regular mittens. Um, for her bottoms, she'll wear leggings, like the leggings that go over your foot, the actual knitted leggings. Then she'll have on her jeans, um, her snow boots, or she'll have on like the leggings with wool socks, her jeans and her snow boots. It just all depends. So. And again, I'm going to be homeschooling, so we're not even going to be outside that much anyways. But yeah, so that's all I got for her um, for her birthday. That is all for today's video. If you guys like today's content of Nevaeh's birthday blog, again, please like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, guys. Peace. And